Today, I want to show you around our brand new Elan Impression 40.1 that we have on display here in the UK on the Hamble River at our sales site. It's only been afloat for a couple of days to complete the commissioning and was taken around to the Southampton Boat Show just before it was cancelled. She's now lifted ashore. She's boat number one on our walkway uh, here at our sales site at Deacon's Marina right by the office and is ready to be viewed. I just want to do a video of her in place before we have a look around. Let's have her wander up and go look up on deck. So here we are ashore on the 40.1. Got the RF platform down. So this is the larger platform option available on the impression range. And stepping up onto the boat, you can see we've got a flush stern down, which is a new feature on this new 40.1. Uh, the old models used to have a slanted one. This also gives us these lovely aft seating areas, which double up as cockpit lockers as well. So more storage available on this new 4.1 range. Got a wooden table on this boat, so under a cover here in the lovely English weather. Moving forward, we've got gate access on each side, another option we've gone for on our stock boat. And the typical set inboard shrouds on the impression range allow an easy access up side deck at any point of sail. The forward deck on these impressions is very spacious and comfortable. Recessed anchor winch there and we've gone for the option of the fixed metric pole as well to allow you fly using huge code zero spinnakers as well. Moving back down the starboard side you can see here all the lines led aft under a bit of covering. Got the stack pack with lazy jacks on this boat so slap you can set up on the main and furly neck Genoa. Lovely big spray hood here. That's a part of the sail ready pack offered by Alan. It's a lovely standard feature we always go for. And we have a teak laid cockpit sole seating combing. Now let's have a look down below. Down below, we have a free cabin two head layout. So the owner's cabin forward with en suite and then two half cabins down the head. We've gone for a nice grey flooring and blue upholstery with newly designed and interior layout. So we've got the large L-shaped galley. This has been upgraded with some larger storage on the uh, back end of the galley there. The lovely big table that flips out, so double the size there, and the flip out table as well with the nav panel. Obviously the one that won all the awards when first released on the GT range. These impressions have a lovely light spacious feel to them and loads of head height. Uh, so they're very accommodating to any point that comes aboard. Moving forward to the owner's cabin at the bow, we've got a very, very generous B berth. Heads on the port side, and then big storage lockers, shelving, access everything all around. The heads on these boats are very nice, comfortable place. Got proper toilet there, pull out tap to make a shower as well, and storage in a mirror. Moving back into the saloon, you can see you've got all the brochures here for the four land range here, the demonstrator boat and the nice light spaciousness. It's actually quite a grey day here in the UK as you'd expect. Here on the starboard side we've got the main day head, single door access and very light and spacious. It's got tinted glass on the windows so a lot of privacy on that large window. The aft cabins are even on the berth sizing so lovely double berth on each one and big storage on shelving. The new feature there is that additional window up high um, allowing a bit more light into the boat, a bit more comfortable in these cabins. As you can see, brand new boat, cell still in the bag, thin plastic, some of the upholstery is still covered up there, and she's ready to go. Feel free to contact us and here at Deacon's Marina if any questions about this Elan impression.